My professor told me I need to have five scholarly articles for my paper, but how do you know which ones are scholarly? If the database that you are searching happens to be in EBSCO, you can check the scholarly peer-reviewed box to find articles that are only in peer-reviewed journals. Unfortunately, it's not as simple as that. Even if this box is checked, you might get articles like this one that are only two pages long and look like this with no bibliography. No bibliography or reference list means that it is not scholarly. So what criteria should I use to determine if it's a scholarly article? First, scholarly articles are usually long. Look for articles that are around 7 to 20 pages long. Second, a scholarly article is written by a scholar. I'm looking at EBSCO, but I don't see the author's degree listed anywhere. How do I know if they're a scholar? If you can't view the author's credentials in the abstract of the article, you can Google the author to see if you can find them online and check their credentials. Third, scholarly articles will contain a section at the beginning which is a literature review of what other scholars have written on the topic. They do this to fill the reader in on the scholarly conversation that has already taken place. At the, finally, at the end of the article, you will see references or a works cited page, also known as a bibliography, in which they list every source they used in the article. This can be a great place for you to get research for your paper. So if I find an article written by someone with a PhD that is 15 pages long and has a lot of articles in the bibliography, then I should be okay? Yes and no. Scholarly articles often contain some kind of study or research that the author has done. There are some articles that are just literature reviews and really don't contain any original content. They are very helpful to get caught up on what others are saying on a topic. But when you use an article as a source for your paper, you want to make sure that you are summarizing an author's work, not just summarizing a person who is summarizing someone else. Thanks so much for your help. I think I might just be ready to find some scholarly articles now.